They're called hoverboards. These two-wheeled self-balancing scooters are shaping up to be a hot gift this holiday season. But before you buy, some owners and safety experts want you to see this. Mom, get some water or something. This is Timothy Cade's brand new hoverboard on fire. I hadn't even rolled it, rode it like 7,500 feet and it exploded, it was just like, Boom! And I'm like, Mom, my hoverboard just blew up. And Kate and like, is not alone. Not there have been reports around the country of like similar like accidents. This is the hoverboard. This Louisiana mom says her son's brand new hoverboard exploded home. moments after it was plugged in, setting her house on fire. I could hear it. It sounded like a lit firework. It was just like that. The boards are largely made in China and imported to the U.S. by companies that market them Several using their own brand. Several hoverboard manufacturers in China declined to comment on the safety concerns. Okay, ready? Uh, yeah. The devices are a lot like the Segway that was popular more than a decade ago, but much cheaper. You can pick one up for less than $300 online. Many are marketed as children's toys. You know, the hoverboards, uh, first and foremost, are not toys. These Sean Kane is the president devices. of Safety and Research and Strategies Incorporated, uh, like a consumer safety advocate. He says there's no way to guarantee they've been safety tested. The hoverboard does not fall into um, categories where there are regulations. So there are no guidelines and standards for this type of device. The safety and fitness of them is really unknown. The fire problems you know, appear to be coming from the charging and potentially the lithium ion batteries. And there's always the risk of a fall. <laughs> Many hoverboards will reach speeds of 12 miles per hour with no handlebars to grab if you lose your balance. The Consumer Product Safety Commission says it's received 20 reports of emergency room related injuries since September. Still, owners of hoverboards seem to love the products. Cade says he's already ordered a replacement from a different company. So I'm hoping they like worked out the kinks. Robert Bumstead, Associated Press. What is going on, dude?